Hello YouTube and welcome to my channel. My channel is a commentary channel where I discuss anything, everything. I like to explore all sorts of topics about life and about death because we're, when we're born we are dying. So I explore topics that I think may interest viewers and lately I seem to have been getting more interest in the areas of missing people. So I thought I would continue that and even though some of these people I have um, covered before, I'm going to redo it. We're going today to have a look at 15 mysterious missing person cases with big rewards for information. Number one, Maura Murray, age 21. Description, Caucasian, 5 foot 7, 120 pounds, light brown hair, blue eyes. Details, disappeared on February the 9th 2004 after her car crashed on Route 112 in Haverhill, New Hampshire. Witnesses saw her around the crash site but she was gone when authorities arrived. Reward $40,000. This is US. Status unclaimed. Number two. Brandon Swanson, age 19. Description, Caucasian, 5 foot 6, 120 pounds, brown hair, blue eyes, wearing glasses. Details, he vanished on May the 14th, 2008, after his car got stuck in a ditch near Taunton. T-A-U-N-T-O-N, Minnesota. He called his parents for help but was never seen again. Reward, 20,000 American dollars. Status, unclaimed. Number three, Brian Schaffer. Brian, age 27. Description, Caucasian, six foot two. 165 pounds, brown hair, hazel eyes. Details, disappeared on April the 1st, 2006 from the Ugly Tuna Saloon Bar in Columbus, Ohio. Surveillance footage shows him entering but not leaving. Reward, 100,000 US dollars. Status unclaimed. Number four, Tara Calico, age 19. Description, Caucasian, five foot seven, 120 pounds, brown hair, green eyes. Details, vanished on September 20, 1988, while hiking on Highway 47 in Bellin, New Mexico. A Polaroid found a year later in Florida possibly depicted, uh, depicted her. Sorry, Reward, $20,000. Status, unclaimed. Number five, Michaela Joy Garrett, age nine. Description, Caucasian, Four foot eight, seventy five pounds, blonde hair, blue eyes. Details abducted on November nineteenth, nineteen eighty eight, from a grocery store parking lot in Haywood, California. Witnesses saw her being dragged into her car. Reward ten thousand dollars. Status unclaimed. Number six, Asher Degree, age nine. Description, 
African American, four foot six, sixty pans, black hair, brown eyes. Details. Disappeared on February the fourteenth, two thousand, from her home in Shelby, North Carolina. She was last seen walking along Highway eighteen. Reward: forty-five thousand dollars U.S. Unclaimed. Number seven, Stephen Kocher, K O E C H E R, age thirty. Description: Caucasian, five foot ten, a hundred and eighty-five pounds, blonde hair, blue eyes. Details: He vanished on December the thirteenth, two thousand and nine, in Henderson, Nevada. His car was found with keys and personal items inside. Reward: ten thousand dollars. Status unclaimed. Number eight, Suzanne Lyle, age nineteen. Description: Caucasian, five foot three, a hundred and seventy-five pounds, brown hair, blue eyes. Details: Disappeared on March the second, nineteen ninety-eight. From the State University of New York at Alabama, she was last seen exiting a bus. Reward: twenty-five thousand dollars. Status: unclaimed. Number nine: Zeb Quinn, age eighteen. Description: Caucasian, five foot nine. A hundred and sixty-five pounds, brown hair, blue eyes. Details: Vanished on January the second, two thousand, in Asheville, North Carolina. His car was found abandoned with bizarre items inside. Reward: twenty thousand dollars. Status: unclaimed. Number ten. Jennifer Kessy, K E S S E, age twenty four. Description: Caucasian, five foot eight, a hundred and thirty pounds, blonde hair, green eyes. Details: Disappeared on January the twenty fourth, two thousand and six, from her. Home in Orlando, Florida. Her car was found a mile away. Reward: fifteen thousand dollars. Status unclaimed. Number eleven, Jody. Who's the known truth? I'm very sorry for the mispronunciation. I'll have given it another go. Who's the truth? H U I. S E N T R U I T, age twenty seven. Description: Caucasian, five foot nine. Sorry, Caucasian, five foot three. Sorry, a hundred and twenty pounds. Blonde hair, brown eyes. Details: Vanished. On June the twenty seventh, nineteen ninety five, from her apartment complex in Mason City, Ohio, on her way to work as a news anchor. So this is a very important person. She was going to be a news anchor. Reward: ten thousand dollars. The status is unclaimed. And so it's Ohio. Hawaii, sorry, Hawaii. I have trouble pronouncing. So it's I O W A where she went missing. I'm very sorry. I, when I smile, it's to cover up my mispronunciation of names. Please forgive me. I get very tongue-tied. It's um, 
it happens when you live alone and all you talk to is a dog you start to have trouble pronouncing big words once upon a time when I went to uni big words came very easy to me but when you start to not use them you know practice makes perfect anyway I'm digressing let's continue number 12 is Jason Jolonski J-O-L-K-O-W-S-K-I Jolonski age 19 description Caucasian 6 foot 1 165 pounds brown hair and brown eyes details disappeared on June the 13th 2001 in Omaha Nebraska while walking to meet a co-worker for a ride to work reward $10,000 status unclaimed 13 Amy Lynn Bradley age 23 description Caucasian 5 foot 6 120 pounds brown hair green eyes details vanished on March the 24th 1998 from a cruise ship in the Caribbean she was last seen on the ship's deck reward two hundred and fifty thousand dollars status unclaimed number 14 Rico Harris age 37 description African American six foot nine so this is a big man six foot nine three hundred pounds bald and brown eyes details disappeared on October the 10th 2014 near Cashier Creek Regional Park in California his car was found abandoned with no trace of him reward $5,000 status unclaimed last but not least number 15 Tammy Lynn Leppert age 18 description Caucasian 5 foot 4 105 pounds blonde hair brown eyes details vanished on July the 6th 1983 from Cocoa Beach Florida she was last seen getting into a car with an unknown male reward ten thousand dollars status unclaimed these cases remain unsolved and the rewards offered have not been claimed adding to the mystery surrounding their disappearances now also I will be doing another video on people on GoFundMe because that is completely different these other rewards were offered either by police or FBI or by the family but GoFundMe is different so let's have a look at GoFundMe ones as always thank you for watching and remember you have a right to your own life you do but you you do matter to people and if you're suffering from a mental illness please get help because you matter and there is help available and yes if you want to go live off the grid if you want to disconnect from your family and friends you have that right 
but please let authorities know that you're all right. Please give your loved ones peace of mind. Nobody can grieve properly when there is no body, when there's just a big hole in their hearts. I hope and I'm very sorry to these people and to all around the world who have lost somebody, whether missing or otherwise. Grief never leaves you and not knowing what happened to the fate of your loved one, that's, that's awful. Something, you know, hard to comprehend. As always, I dedicate this video to a wonderful man. Please watch him, David Politis. Thanks for watching. Cherish every moment. Love the best you can. Love, light and blessings. And I'll be back part two. Sorry, I haven't been around. I have been sick. I've had a virus. Still recovering. Back soon. Bye.